you can either have two choices, right? You can have an on-premise laundry or you can outsource. Um, when you outsource, you lose control. You lose control of quality. You lose control of when delivery is. Uh, items get lost. You get charged. You know, you, all of a sudden, it, what looks like a good contract, and all of a sudden, all the hidden fees start happening. So being able to have it in-house, if you can, again, properly size it, properly staff it, you're able to run that very efficiently. And you can control the quality. You can control how your linen's being washed, which means that you can control the longevity of it. Right now, linen costs are staggeringly expensive. And as hotels continue to upgrade their thread counts and offer, hey, we've got the best linens, well, that's a major investment. And so to be able to properly treat that, make sure that you're not overwashing and over bleaching it and destroying that very, very expensive linen uh, it is an important step in managing your budget, but also making sure the laundry is running efficiently, that you're not eating that sale, those savings up by not operating properly. We've seen people outsource, the, particularly some of the larger hotels, because of the, 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 the pure immense size of the laundry requirements. Um, if you get a 500, 700 room hotel, you know, you're generating thousands of pounds of laundry a day. So that's a big operation in logistics. And uh, sometimes they like to convert those spaces into event spaces or they just physically don't have, you know, they might be downtown, so it's hard to get get the equipment in and out or it's in a basement, whatever, right? Or on a third floor. There's always reasons sometimes people just physically can't have their laundry in their, their properties. But, uh, you know, just an average, you know, 70 to 100, 200 room hotel, majority of those people will have on-premise laundries. 